Hello and welcome back to the Game of Muscle YouTube channel where we're jumping in and we're going to be playing through Cuphead. And you might have asked yourself the question, what is Cuphead? And well, the answer is it's a 1930s style, graphically at least, 2D action platformer. It uh, should be interesting. And I'm sure we're going to get immediately flagged for copyright infringement of the music. But, you know, that's the price you have to pay. Now, I'm proper hyped for this. We could be playing Forza 7, but no, we're playing Cuphead. We're going to be playing using the Xbox 360 controller. And we've got some French putty, putty carrière, putty carrière biscuits. First of all, options. This is literally the first time we loaded the game up, so anything could happen. Visual. Uh, well, this is like Xbox resolution. 1920 by 10. Oh. Hello. Why don't we have our resolution? There we go. 1920 by 1080. Full screen V-Sync. Off. Overscan. Don't know what that's about. Brightness, colour, there we go, there's uh, advanced options, but it doesn't matter, it's a platformer. Hello Erin Vanderbor, hello Tim Nishbor, hello Amster, hello big boy Mitch. Back, let's start this off. New, this is like the old three save game thing going on. Oh yes, it's been a while since i played a proper game. And already you can tell this has got nice polish to it. Now for those of you who don't know... Yes. So for those of you that don't know, they the developers of this originally showed it off at E3 2015, and then then they uh, then they were like, oh no, actually, we it looked like it got popular, and the developers were like, okay, well we'll mortgage our house and everything, and <laughs> delete everything, start again, and make it into an even bigger game. So the developers uh, went crazy and uh, delayed it until now. Make it into a what it would have been a smaller game, but now it's a you know crazy full-on game. Only fifteen pounds though, so really, from the videos I've seen for fifteen quid, it looks like it's gonna be amazing. If you like platformers, what a fine pickle you boys have got it yourself into, chappy boy. I know I got I got in there. I'm spit. I'm, I'm on the limit when it comes to starting the stream. I mean, this looks so slick. Oh, we're gonna do the tutorial. Let's see if uh, let's see if we can do the tutorial. Rumor has it it's nigh on impossible. Look at the animations of the character are really nice. It's really slick. Press jump whilst holding airborne. As they do that, uh, the, the frame pause thing when you do it, so it, it sort of pauses the game briefly. Play the game with a wheel. I don't think it will detect the wheel. 
so it feels really slick. Really nice how they got, you know, like... The, because it's in that old style, when they do something modern, like the 3D coin there, it really stands out. This, yeah, this is the one where the game journalist couldn't get through that tutorial screen. Oh, a bit of a pause there. It's not exited the game, I hope. Oh, there we go. <laughs> it's awesome. Run and gun, there we go. Yeah, I'm expecting the... I'm expecting the copyright police to do us. Ah, I'm a noob. Ah, I'm so bad. I'm turning around. I'm going to jump on people's heads as well. No, I died. That's it. <laughs> Gonna have to concentrate. Gotta get a platform mode back in. Can't use the pedals. It's actually interesting now. It's a the, the shooting instead of jumping on people. It's quite different. I don't know if you if you can jump on people, but you do have to shoot them. You, you can't jump on the head. No, you do, you do have to shoot him. Ain't no jumping. This isn't Super Mario. Just got a pair of five gears. No, it's only got four. It's a, a vintage car. Oh, my God. <laughs> Getting destroyed here, right? We have to concentrate. Level one. <laughs> Level one. Third attempt. Third attempt. Format the C drive. It certainly isn't uh, Super Mario. This is going to turn into uh, Super Meat Boy, isn't it? Punishment gaming. Whoa! Oh, they keep bloody coming. Bloody hell. Why do they keep respawning? It's a bit harsh. This is the first level! <laughs> this is harder than... Um... Oh my god, they're from everywhere. I mean, I can just hold down fire button. That's easier. This is harder than uh, metal Metal Slug. Holding down fire does make it easier. I wasn't expecting it to be this difficult, you know. Whoa. Oh, how do we get this? Oh, if we do the parry attack. No. What was dash? Ah, oh, that's... <laughs> Why is dash again? Oh, my God. Okay, we're halfway through the level. Hang on. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. <sighs> Cup of tea. We've... I've forgotten how to play games here. Hello, Mark Bird Broad Broadshaw. Mark... From Mark Bird Mark Bird Broad Broadshaw. Hello. Bloody hell, this game's harsh. Definitely way harder than um, 
way harder than uh, Rayman. Not Super Meat Boy level hard. Mind you, Super Meat Boy is not always that hard. because It depends, it's because you're meant to fail at Super Meat Boy. You just sort of repeat levels. Can you, maybe you can dash attack people? No. I'm feeling like there's, there's rather than just a shoot in there, there's that. No. There's not like a close attack, so you really do have to get everything at a distance. Oh no, this is going to be punishing, guys. Right, this is this is going to be punishing for you. <laughs> this is going to be punishing for people watching. Hype, first level hype. to concentrate. This is going to be good. This is going to be how many levels you think we'll do in the next hour. One stage. We at least it's got infinite lives, it appears. It's because the enemies keep respawning. It's so harsh. we kill this guy. No, you can't kill that. Oh my god. Come on. Well, I'm terrible with this. No. This is hard. Maybe I should... Ah! <laughs> ah! Why am I so bad at this? I mean, this is, diff this is difficult. Oh, dear. I, I thought this was going to be casual land. I could get my game back on. Let's see how. This is why I don't play normal computer games. It's just too punishing. You play driving sims. All you have to do is learn the lap and push some buttons. Come on. There we go. Oh god, that thing fires crap at you. There's so much stuff on the screen. Come here, you little mushroom. Are oh, you? Come on. No. Come on. No. Oh, no, this is terrible. We're not even. I can't even get to the end of the first level. I... What am I doing? I can't get to the end of the first level. This is horrendous. So what? what is Cuphead? Apparently it turns out it's bloody hard. This is harder than Metal Slug. Ah! Oh! Don't try, don't try to play platformers after playing driving sims. Oh my god, a sneaky little bugger. There's so much stuff going on here. What got in that time? Okay. No. Okay, we got that. Bloody hell, there's so much stuff on the... Oh, oh. Come on, first level, first level, first level, first level. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There's even more crap on the screen. Come oh, God. Nearly there, nearly there, nearly there, nearly there. There it is. No! Oh! <laughs> what? I thought, I thought we had to touch. I thought it was like Sonic the Hedgehog. Oh... I thought we had to just touch it. Because you play Tony Hedgehog, you just jump on the thing at the end of the level. 15 minutes and we haven't done the first... <laughs> 15 minutes and we haven't got to the first end of the first level. Hi, Dandy. Hi, Raymond. I don't, I'm torturing myself. I'm going to have to go back to driving simulators. Here we go.
I honestly didn't think this would be this hard. <laughs> this game's gonna this is gonna get a lot of uh, playtime out of uh, the fifteen pounds here. I have a suspicion it's it's gonna be like one of those games though where you know once you get to grips with it, it's not actually that bad, but you kind of have to get two grips with it. It's the shooting aspect, I think. This is quite different. Rather than jumping on stuff. Like, you don't have a... You don't have a close range attack. So, normally, in stuff like... Um, um, Rayman and Mario and what have you. When stuff gets close to you, you're actually stronger. So, it's actually easier to deal with it. And this is quite tight. Oh, my, see, you can't jump into anything. And it's instant death if you fall. Oh, maybe if you're playing... What? Where did he come from? Bloody hell. Oh, I, I forgot you can't kill them. You... <laughs> You, we were so close. You can't kill those things. Now go. Oh my god. Maybe because this is a the run and gun. Maybe it's a special stage. Maybe I'm, I'm actually meant to just not stop. We'll see. Maybe I've just picked a bad first stage. Oh my god, this is so hard. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> oh god, this is harder. This is harder than the last race we had. Like you said. Play with a wheel. God, it's not going to happen. I'll be suicidal if I try and play this with a wheel. Bloody... Oh, you arsehole! No! Oh, my God. It's those blue things. They come... You can't kill them. What was the... How did we do the special attack? I don't get the, the parry attack thing. I think it's only if there's stuff on the screen. Hi, Quigolo. <laughs> Have you got this, Quigolo? This is bloody difficult. Oh, my God. Have you got this, Quigolo? This is this is your kind of game. Quigolo's an animator. He loves this kind of stuff. Oh my god! I don't know how I did that pirate. I can't remember. I wasn't paying attention. Oh, the little blue bugger thing. I'm hoping this is a special stage. Because <laughs> it is so hard. I hope the whole game's not this hard. I can't take it. I can't take it. Hi, Cybershotty. The force feedback's a little bit lacking. Let's have a look. Is that like a special... That is hard. Don't think we have to do that. Oh, okay. We'll try to see if this is harder. 
Oh, is, this, is it a special stage? What? What is this? Jesus Christ, what's going on? Oh my god, I was not expecting this game to be so mental. Ah, ah. Nice. Oh, oh god. Oh no. <laughs> okay, this isn't as crazy. <laughs> Take that, you onion! Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, this is this is okay. This isn't. Ah. Uh. Oh, there we go. So you have to charge up your... You have to charge up your cards at the bottom corner. Yeah, I got off steam. This came out today. Oh, this is certainly different. Why would they put that special stage right at the beginning? Oh, there goes one life. It doesn't show this guy's health, which is annoying, because I want to know how close I am to beating him. Oh, you little... Oh, my... Oh, okay, so we were pretty close there. We're okay, we've got this. Yeah, I need I need more force feedback. I need to play this with a direct drive wheel. Oh, I might as well die now and start again. High speed pulse. <laughs> I, just, I just thought, you know what? I love to get punished by games. The uh, actual platform mechanics, though, the movement and everything seems really nice. Animation's really nice as well. I'm just terrible at this. Oh my god. No cigar. This is laser scans, yeah, you can tell by the detail. This alright, this guy's easy to beat. We're gonna have to switch to easy. <laughs> We're gonna have to put the uh, steering assist on in a minute. Okay, here we go. Let's just hammer this carrot. Oh, we've got to aim before I shoot. Oh, it's this bloody... Ah! When you do that fire, you stand still. You can only shoot in diagonals. It's so hard. Oh, and then when you stop, when you stop to aim, you obviously are more of a target. Yes, his hand-drawn laser scanned. Oh, my God. This is so punishing. Close. Right. Most it does. You've got, uh, yeah. Oh, I just walked right into him. I'm such a noob. It really does. It does have that sort of classic platform and gameplay to it, though. Just learning patterns and stuff. Okay. Let's beat this bloody carrot. One, come on. We can beat one level. One level of this game, please. One level. If I can beat one level, I'll be happy. I'm just not standing still. Have that carrot face. Come on, take that. Ah! Can't go in the corner because he gets you. Come on, you bloody carrot. Ha! Ah! 
Come on! Why would he die? No! No! Oh. Die! <laughs> Why has he got so much life compared to the other guy? Oh, that's it! No. Oh my god. He's just invincible! Oh, we done it! We done it! We done it! Jesus! This is harder than doing, learning the Nordschleifer. <laughs> oh my god, this game is so hard. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it to be so brutal. Why does the tar carrot look like he's going to sneeze when he's getting his third eye? I don't know, he's focusing. It's, it, it, it's a bit hard, it's, it's got to say Okay, that's... Oh, we've done the first level. You got the root pack soul contract. Nice. That was intense. It's not just Mickey Mouse. It's 1930s style 2D comic. You know, obviously Mickey Mouse is what people remember, but it's just a comic book style, a co cartoon style from the 1930s. There's loads of... Uh... It's not just Mickey Mouse for that time period. Humph. Oh Here we go. The most realist, not the most realistic. A great slam and then stop. Oh my! I was see. I was expecting this to be a game that you could play with someone that's maybe not that good at games. But I mean, I'm I'm not I'm not that good at games. But this is, as I say, this is harder than Metal Slug. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, I pushed the wrong button. No! Oh, dear. <laughs> Sonic Sonic is like a hundred times easier than this. This is getting to um, Super Meat Boy level difficulty. Jesus. Uh, yeah, I'll be doing more PCARs tomorrow. And a set of Corsa. Oh, you probably stick to driving simulators. I suck at this kind of game. I thought this was going to be nice, chilled out, relaxing. I thought, oh, you know, there'll be some nice graphics, some nice cartoon style stuff to look at. It won't be too hard. I wasn't expecting Super Meat Boy 1930s style. I guess probably should have checked more about the game. going to happen now? Oh. I, I mean, how am I supposed to work out what's about to happen? Am I meant to pull the handle? Oh, I think I'm meant to. Yeah, it's, pit, it's pink, so I was meant to melee attack it. Try the Konami code. Oh, dear. This is bloody hard. I, I wasn't expecting this. I'll take it though. Oh my god. Oh dear. Well, I might as well just die and start again. Maybe I should try it on normal. Clearly don't have the skill. Going to be a hit. Need more rage. 
This game's gonna get a reputation for driving people crazy. <laughs> The fact that you can only shoot at angles as well is so harsh. It's like a... This is Nintendo hard, almost. Okay, he's going to do his bouncy thing now. And he does the wind. At least when you do this attack, it pauses you. Oh, you arse. I don't know if there's any value in using them, because I don't know if this is all just... There we go. So I'm sp I think I'm supposed to melee attack this. There we go. <laughs> oh. But I don't know what's going to happen until it bloody happens. Oh, shit. This is so harsh. <laughs> this is surely this is the last one. Down. Oh my god. Oh my god. You can't even touch the edges of it either because it's spiky. Sixty for every controller thrown in. Oh, I see what you're saying, yeah. This is quite frustrating. This is rage inducing. <laughs> uh, dear, I need my tea. Bit more tea. Hi Xander MCN. I'm I'm getting punished here. I've done one level. I've done one level. It's been 30 minutes and I've done one one level in 30 minutes. I mean that doesn't say much because I'm terrible at these get are oh, you absolute you bloody frog. That, yeah, I'm not good at these games, I don't necessarily say much, but I play Metal Slug a fair bit on my mobile phone, and that's got a reputation for being hard. I mean, it's not so hard on your mobile because you've, um, on the modern version, the emulated version of Metal Slug, you can, I might as well just die, so I'm not going to, yeah. it's designed as an arcade game, so you can continue, so it makes it easier, but I've done most levels in that without having to continue. This is, this is harder. Clearly not a casual platformer. Right. Get these. Bastard frogs. There you go. Okay, now he does his... Oh, you sneaky little bastard! He, he throws some of them different. Sod off. And jump. Right, here we go. This bit shouldn't be too bad as long as it's just you can't make any mistakes. Now I know what's going on. That's half the game working out. Hang on. This is different. Ah! Oh! Jesus Christ! Okay. Surely I've only got to do like three or four of them. Oh God! 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 No! 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 There we go. Got a pattern going. They're all the same speed. It's fine. Woo! Come on! It's been it's been gentle on me. Those ones are easier than the other ones. This game's all right. Oh, but I've not said tigers. What's this? What's this shit? Oh, sod off. You fuck off. 
No! Come on, that's gotta be it. Why is it different every time? I can't. Oh, I've done it! <laughs> Jesus Christ. This is the worst game. This is the worst. I didn't do any brand new record grades. Grade C? So I guess you can do it perfectly, you get different grades, but I don't want to play that ever again. You don't need to shoot. Yeah, I'm just holding down the button though because I'm scared to do anything else. Yeah, guys, um, this is torture. This is one of those games. Hi, Chuck. Welcome to Gaming Muscle Videos. <sighs> two level. Right, we've been going for 36 minutes and we've done two levels. I want to do that shooting level. I feel like we can get to the end of it now. The thing is, if I'd have known it was this hard, I wouldn't have bought it. I, I purposely don't get games like this anymore because they're just, they're just too stressful. It, it's just too much. This is, this, I'm not sure if it's fun. That's the thing. It's like that. It's like old Nintendo games. Is it fun doing stuff repeatedly and trying to get past it? It's not like Rocket League where you know you get better at it over time. It's tricky, but you know it, you can sort of apply. It's more like a planning thing. So even with Counter-Strike, it's more of a planning thing. A lot of this seems to be learning patterns. That is getting easier. I can see it's, something's clicking a little bit. I'm, I'm gelling with the game. I vaguely understand what's going on now. We're learning the buttons. But... That's, the other thing is, you get games like this is where the developers played it for hours. So for them, they're like, oh, this is easy. It's like Super Meat Boy or those Mario Maker stages. So it's easy for them. But then when you come to it as a person that doesn't play these type of games, you have a mental breakdown. Sod off, blue little bastard. They come back as you little sodding blue bastard thing. Okay, I'll check the chat room in a second, guys. But this is this is demanding 100% of my attention. Yeah, this this is like the platform equivalent of iRacing. racing. Okay, get the little blue bastard. Look at his little smarmy face. There we go. Sod off. No, nope. and jump across there. Ah, oh, fuck! Jump. Come on. Come on. Sod you, you mushroom piece of crap. <laughs> this is, I'm just getting angry. This is so stressful. Oh, I did it! Wait, let's get We're getting it. We're getting into the zone. Oh, my God. Yeah, probably we'll have to go back to Project Cars. This can be the interlude for when I want more punishment. This is like... Every, every game of this is like playing... It's like playing... Um, Oh, we got a great B minus. Congratulations, productivity award. It's like T1. Playing games like this is like doing T1 on a public server over and over again, as if that's a fun thing to do. But it's addictive. So I, it's a, this is a good game. You can't deny it. The graphics are fantastic. The music's fantastic. The gameplay is it's that old school type. You know, the actual core gameplay. Not old school gameplay, but you know, Super Meat Boy type, tight platforming. Just, it's just like having someone s smack you in the face with a stick repeatedly. So if you like that type of gameplay, but well, I can't get up there. I can jump in the in three D. Oh, why can't I get up there now? Oh well. Oh hello, sexy fish. That's how you deal with ghosts? Press the escape button. <laughs> Uh, force feedback, so it's a bit vague in this. Mausoleum, here we go. Swiss <laughs> Gate. Oh my April god. Is oh, so I have to get these with. What? You have April to hit. 
Okay, so I have to double press A on them. And the animation's really nice in this. Need no more str I know. Oh, you can fall onto them with a parry attack. That's cool. So you don't have to get the timing exactly on them. I have to say this has really satisfying player movement. Why do I punish myself? I do not know. I wonder if we can get like a double. Let's see if we can parry two of them. I'm getting an achievement for it, hopefully. Come on. What? They kill you even if you're not that close to them. That's a bit harsh. Oh no, they got to. Uh, <laughs> I'm so dense. They get to this, you lose. Oh, you can't. I don't think you can do. Yeah, you can't do two. Vote P card 2. We would have played eight hours of Project Cars 2 today. Got to mix it up a little bit. You're lucky I'm not playing Forza 7. This it was it was Forza 7 or this. I probably will play Project Cars 2 later. Don't worry. We'll give it half an hour or so. This is better than Pub, Pub, um, PUBG, easily. <laughs> no, it's a different game, obviously. This is it's just a torture game. I mean, PUBG is a torture game as well, to be honest, because, you know, you play, like you say, you play it for 30 minutes and you get randomly killed. What is that about? This is predictable. Predictable torture. PUBG's random torture. Victory. There you go. That level's nice and easy. I don't have a problem with Forza 7. I just, I just reluctant to pay 80 quid for it. I'll probably pick up for 50 so I can do reviews of it. I think it might be quite fun to play with the gamepad, to be honest. This is the best cuphead. Hi, Pete Hill. Oh, you were the guy that asked the question that I just answered. I was half asleep. Forza is worth, Forza is worth 50. If Forza was 25 quid, I'd buy it right now. I'd, it's just 80 quid's a lot of money for a game that I'm gonna play like how I will. If you're gonna play Forza for hundreds of hours and you know, it's your cup of tea, then you'll get the value from it. But it's not for me. <laughs> Sorry, Pete Hill. Blown fuse. I, I've got Mario Kart um, on the Wii U. I really like it. Oh, what's this? Oh, that's nice. Well, so what am I doing now? Now I've done that. Great. <laughs> How do I... I guess I've got to do more. Can't get up there. We'll go up here then. What? I just... That's where we started, so how do I get out of this area? I am trapped. Well, what am I supposed to do here? Hidden object games. Yeah, they're actually, yeah. I used to really like, um, you know, um, uh, what they called? What's that game? <laughs> What's that game? What's it called? Full, full, full throttle. What? 
I don't know how you jump on the menu screen. Ah, oh, cheeky little. They're, bit, they're trolls, these developers. This is a total troll. Total troll game. Right. Let's do this stage and we're back to the driving simulators. I can only take 45 minutes of this game at a time. It is really. You can tell it's, it is a really good game. This is really nicely done. It's, it's enough different to the platform thing. It's tight, but this is bloody stressful. It's nice seeing the different characters, though, the animations and everything. And then it's nice having a mental breakdown once in a while. I think I'm just supposed to run through. Don't need to kill everything. Jesus. How do I get that? Can I parry attack these, do you think? The pink ones. Come on. Ah, oh, there we go. Tight. Oh my god. Yeah, we've got to do this level. <laughs> I'm going to need Euro Truck Simulator after this. Can I parry attack this guy? Ah, oh, there we go. That's cool. Anything that's pink, you can parry attack. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm going to do this level and then we're done. It's probably going to take another hour. Fucking hell. Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm going to just die again. That's it. You need a... Yeah, you need a 1080 Ti and you need at least three virtual reality headsets to play this. This game should be my punishment. If I cause a T1 crash, I have to do a level in this game. <laughs> this, this is punishing, though. Oh, my God. Get, get away from me. <laughs> like Super Meat Boy, I have to say, I'm, I, I'm not sure how much fun this is. I mean, this feels like work in some ways. That's why I don't get with these kind of games. Ah, <laughs> oh, the timing. Oh my god! It's too hard! There's just holes everywhere! No! Last. Oh, well, we're not doing this level. Jesus. Let's get this thing. You, I mean, even Super Mario, you get like regenerative health every now and again. You don't even get that in this. That's cool. Nah. Oh, you can't touch him! <sighs> I was only halfway through. Yeah, I can't take this anymore. I can't take it. 50 minutes. <laughs> 50 minutes and three levels in. It's a good game though. Just bloody punishing. I'm never gonna complete this. This will be one to do on a plane if I've got a long journey. It, yeah, well, you should play it if you think it looks easy. I, may, I, I am not particularly good at these types of games, but we've done, hang on, we've done one, two, Three, four levels. Four levels in 50 minutes. Ah, uh, that's, that's as much as I can take of Cuphead for now. Thank you, Studio MDR, for the torture. It presents itself as a happy 1930s game and is more like hell, literal hell in video game form. But... Right, guys, I'm I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna uh, turn this off. I recommend it though. 
For £15, if you want to be punished, this is a good game to get. It's a good game to punish. If you like Super Meat Boy, if you like hardcore platformers, it'd be interesting to see what the uh, two the uh, two player modes are, because that makes it a lot easier. But even so, um, this will really appeal to people that I think, you know, have been looking at it. And uh, I think I need more training at it. But on that note, guys, I'm going to end the stream there. That's, that's Cuphead. Congratulations, Cuphead. Let's, let's run the credits for this stream. Let's see if we can get that a bit slicker. And then I think we can go back to some driving simulators because I'm a bit sad and all I can cope with are games with cars. That's what's happened. So if you play driving simulators, you lose all ability to play anything else and uh, you just turn into a, a miserable car person. I could do VR games. It's not all gone. Um... We've got VR games always. I have to say, though, it, obviously that, that is harder than Rayman and Super Mario and those type of games. So it is, it is really like it's sort of super punishing type genre. Why am I on a social blade? That's not right. I need... Streamlabs. Happy Miserable Car Person, Train Simulator, Miserable Cars, I need to get Train Sim World, we've got Euro Truck Sim, you know, those those are the tried and tested sims, you can't go wrong with them, they, you know, they anything with a steering wheel or a gun, done, uh, uh, you know, or even a gamepad, even Forza with a gamepad, you know, it's nice and simple, it, it's easy to get a hold of doesn't require too much too much reaction times so it all happens slowly world of tanks I don't particularly like it's too too uh, grindy okay let's see if these credits work and then we'll then we'll uh, stop the stream and see and we'll see what we can go back to Yeah, there's definitely a bug on this. <laughs> that was the credits. That was the credits. <laughs> Did you see the credits? That was it. It was a popular stream. That, <laughs> that was the credits, guys. <laughs> <laughs> you might have missed it. That was the credits. So I might try and replay the credits there, just in case. Just in case you missed it. Yep, that was it. No, it, that's it. <laughs> that was the credit. That was the credits. <laughs> that was the credits. There you go. Well, we'll be back in a bit. Um, <laughs> time to... Uh, I think we can get a little bit more Project Cars 2 in. So if you want any of that, stick around. If not, just um, format your C drive. I'll see you guys in a bit. Thanks for watching. Thanks for joining in.